Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you my nighttime skincare routine. So it changes depending on the items that I have um, with me. Like if I run out, then obviously I'm going to switch it up. But I'm going to go ahead and show you the products that I use. Um, like I said, if I run out of a product, I'll go ahead and use a replacement. So first I like to remove my makeup. What I use to remove my makeup, it's called the Makeup Eraser. So years ago, I probably would say it was probably 2014, 2013, or maybe it was 2015, but I came across the video of Neutrogena, okay? I was a diehard Neutrogena fan for years, right? For years, for years, for years, until I came across this video, okay? This video where they literally test on animals. Now granted, you know, I didn't really know much, you know, about beauty brands or skincare brands that test on animals. So wasn't really educated on what that entails until I saw this video. Let me tell you, once I saw this video and then literally the, the animals, their skins were burning off, like were burnt off. And that's what it truly says, you know, when they're tested on animals. After I noticed that video, I literally stopped using Neutrogena completely. So I started using baby wash to wash my face until I came across, um, it was Burt's Bees. And um, Burt's Bees, they're cruelty free, okay? Now, um, I was using them for a few years and then when I got pregnant, my last pregnancy, um, it just wasn't working anymore for me. Um, I mean, it was, but I was still having breakouts and again, maybe that was just hormonal stuff. But my sister really caught me on to Tatcha. And if you guys saw my Amazon favorites, you guys are going to know about these products. So they'll be familiar to you guys. But um, basically, that leads me into what I use for my face. So to take off my makeup, I started using, instead of the Neutrogena wipes, or instead of the Equate makeup wipes, which I started using those after I learned about Neutrogena, I started to use the makeup eraser. This is just a very soft pad as you can see. And this takes off your makeup super de duper quick. So after like a few swipes, maybe after like a, a swipe, it already depends on um, if you have waterproof mascara, waterproof eyeliner, uh, waterproof, you know, products on your face. Maybe it might take a little bit more swipes, but what I love about this, and this is not sponsored, but what I love about this is that you literally just need water. You don't need any products to remove it. You just need water. So you'll go ahead and put this under the water, you know, and then you'll go ahead and drain it out. And then you'll go start, you know, swiping your face and start swiping the makeup off, which I love. The next product that we're gonna jump into is my facial cleanser. Again, if you guys saw my Amazon favorites, this is not gonna be any news to you, but this is the one that I use, the Deep Cleanse from Tatcha. Now, the alternative that I used to use before, which was Burt's Bees, it's the facial cleanser for sensitive skin. I do have very sensitive skin, so this is the one that I would use. And keep in mind, I am no professional at all when it comes to skincare. These are those products that worked for me. After I wash my face is a moisturizer. This is the one that's kind of like my ride or die. It's the water, um, the water cream. Again, it's by Tatcha. And I'm gonna show you real quick how much I love this thing. Do you guys see that? Literally, I have scraped it off. Like there's no more in here. So, sister, if you're watching this video, I need some more. I also need some more of this too. I love you. Um but yeah, so I'm gonna be um, substituting the Tatcha water cream for the 1212 Gateway Moisturizer. Um, this one is much thicker than the water base. Obviously the water base, it absorbs into my skin way, 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 way quicker. Whereas this one, it's very thick consistency and I love it so much too. Um, then I'm going to be using my under eye cream. Now again, if you guys saw my Amazon favorites, if you haven't, don't worry, I'll link it in the description below. But this is my eye cream. So it's by Origins. This is really good for those of you who have under eye bags um, that are purple bluish bags. And it also helps with depuffing and brightening that area. So love this. 
And last thing I'm gonna use is my facial oil by Burt's Bees. I love this so much. Um, I feel like this also hydrates my skin. Just use two little drops and you put it on your fingers and you rub your hands and you put it on your face, you pat it and then you can massage it up. And there you go. That is my skincare routine. Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you me washing my face, me taking off my makeup. I'm gonna go from pretty little Vicky to Vicky La Fea. So in just a few seconds, you see me. If you guys like this video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And turn on the post notifications to be notified the next time that I post a video. All right guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn on the water. Let me just roll my sleeves up. I'm sorry guys, it is very cold in my house, so that's why I'm wearing a sweater. But I like to use um, warm water when I am taking off the makeup from my face. I'm just waiting for it to warm up. All right, you guys ready? This is, when I first started using this, I was like, there's no way this is gonna work without makeup. Because I've always been used to either using, um, I forgot what it was, but it was by number seven brand um, when I wasn't using the Equate um, makeup remover wipes and i was like there is no way no way this is gonna work but here i am to prove you wrong it's gonna work look at this look at that my ojeras are back my other bags are back to play. I gently massage over my eyelashes because I do have my contacts on, so I don't want to rub too much or too hard. Plus, your eye area is very, very, very sensitive, so you want to make sure that you're very gentle with that eye area. And as you can see, look at that, it's already off. I got this, by the way, how it's a mini size. When my sister took me to Sephora, um, she she had got me the, the Tatcha um, face wash, right? So I can try it out before I spend the money on it. And I think she got me the um, the sample size to start off with. So I can see if I liked it. And oh my god. They gave me this as like one of like the little gifts. And I'm like, okay, you know. Yeah, I'll, I'll get that, you know. I also got like... Um, it was either a lipstick or a mascara from Selena Gomez's um, Rare Beauty line. And I got that along with this thing and something else. Like, oh, it was a liquid lip. And um, I'm like, there's no way in hell this is going to work. <laughs> was I wrong? So I no longer use, I don't longer spend money on makeup remover wipes. Like, I am. Girl, who are you? I don't know you. I don't know her. Mm -mm. No siree. So I'm going to go ahead and take off the other side of my makeup. So you see how that side is off? See? This side is still on. I'm going to go and take it off. Now look again. Look at that, dude. That is insane. Isn't that wild? So, so wild. I'm like, still super shocked that this thing works so well. And by the way, the way that I clean it is with um, a bar of soap that I keep here only for this. And every time I use it, I clean it right away. I don't let any germs, you know, pile up on it because that's pretty gross. Just like new. So what I also like to do is just take water, put it on my face, like so, turn off the water, and I'm going to go in with my Tatcha, uh, the deep cleanse. I'm going to take that much, go like this, and we're going to wash our face. I like to do this for like a few seconds, probably like 30 seconds to a minute, and just like really massage my face. After you wash your face, you want to go ahead and pat your face dry. Alright, so now that we have a clean face, 
we're gonna go ahead and start adding in our products I'm gonna start off with the eye cream I've used a lot of it as you can see used a lot of product already so we're gonna go ahead and just take a dab of it so like about that much probably put too much but I put it on both ring fingers you know that's a little too much so what I do is I go like this I'll go under your eye Softly go under the under eye. You want to go to like the edge of your eyes because we don't want no crow's feet over here. Over the eyelid. Because you guys saw that my moisturizer literally has nothing in it. I'm going to see if I can get any. Ooh, I got some out of it. So, this is how much I got out. What? All right. I literally thought it wasn't gonna be able to get anything off. It's like my face like drinks it. Like it's like so fast. I like using the Burt's Bees facial oil. I press the button on here twice. So it should look like this. And then we're gonna go ahead and put two drops. So it should look like that. I'm gonna rub it through your fingers. Make sure that whatever you do to your face, you do to your neck. Um, right now, I totally forgot my moisturizer. If you guys looked at my Amazon favorites, I have the Nivea moisturizer that I put on my neck, on my arms, on my hands. All right, guys, and there you have it. That's how I do my skincare. If you guys did like this video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And make sure to turn on your post notifications to be notified the next time that I post a video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you guys in the next one. Bye.